Another day, another dollar. Thank the Lord for another 24. God, I do that with you. Just finishing up, working out. Man, got a little home workout in, man. But I want to talk today about these online haters. Man, I got to remind y'all. I just want to remind y'all. Keep y'all's foot on these haters' neck. These online internet trolls, internet clowns that come on our page hating, leaving their little goofy two cents. You know, nobody asked you for your opinion. Nobody cares what you think, man. Especially if you trying to tell me I'm doing something wrong, you know, then I go on your page. You ain't got no profile picture, no videos you working out, what you look like. I don't care what you got to say, man. You feel me? You see what I look like. I, you, I obviously, it's obvious that I work out, right? You know what I'm saying? It's obvious. You know, when I'm out in public, people stop me and ask me. They say things like, how long you been working out? Or, you know, how long did it take you to get that big? When I'm at the gym, people ask me for tips, gym tips. So it's obviously I'm doing something right. You know, if you ain't, if, ain't, if nobody's asking you or on your page asking for gym advice, so why would you even be giving out gym advice? You know, you know what I'm saying? It just don't make no sense, man. Before I get any uh, further into this video, man, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Smash that subscribe button at the Ghetto Bodybuilder, man. Follow me on my Instagram. TikTok, same username, Act the Ghetto Bodybuilder. I got merchandise for sale. First team, all gym, man. Shop on my website, www.theghettobodybuilder.com, man. I got it all, man. Hoodies, uh, T-shirts, all of it, man. Anything you need me, motivational stuff, stuff to keep people fired up for the gym and life, man, in general. But back to the subject, man. If nobody's uh, on your page asking you, or if you at the gym and you know for a fact nobody ask you for advice or tips, what makes you think that you a guru and you wanna come on somebody else's page and tell them that they doing something wrong? You, it just don't make no sense, man. Make it make sense to me. I'll be really like looking at some of these comments like, man, then I go on a page, I'm like, bro, bro, ain't even got no profile pic. You know, let, let me see what you look like, man. If you like, if you like 6'4", 270, all muscle, then I'm gonna respect your opinion, you know? But if you ain't got no picture, man, for all I know, you probably don't even own a gym membership. You probably don't even work out for all I know. You could be anybody, man. You could be a damn kid, a hundred pounds, man, trying to tell me about working out. You know what I'm saying? It just don't make no sense. Or somebody that's a damn couch potato, 500 pounds, man, trying to tell me something about, my, about working out. It don't make no sense. You know, and I don't say this to be cocky or nothing, or you know, but I've been working out 20 years, you know, 20 years straight. I've never taken off more than a week or two from working out at the gym, or even if I'm at the crib doing a home workout in 20 years. You know, I'm a former athlete, you know, so I always worked out for sports anyway. And then when I stopped playing football in college, I kept up with it. You know what I'm saying? So. The stuff that I, I I see like these people making comments and stuff, man. I'm like, I, I've been doing this shit probably, you know, longer than some of y'all been alive. You know, I probably got more time on the toilet, you know, using the bathroom than your whole gym career than you got working out, man. You know, I'm just keeping it 100, man. You know, I try to stay humble, you know, and be respectful and humble. But sometimes you gotta let motherfuckers know, man. You just not anybody, man. You not just gonna come on here telling me this and that, man. If I'm doing this shit wrong, post the video. This is this is the crazy part about this shit, though, right? Every time I reply, and I be like, if I'm doing it wrong, post the video of you doing it. You know, I learn I learn better visually. Let me see you do it. Let me see what you look like. They never respond. They never respond, bro. I got screenshot. I can screenshot plenty instances, man, where I respond. I'd be like, well, let me see how you do it. Let me see your your method to the madness. They never respond, man. Yeah, hiding behind the internet, man. It's a sad world, man. The internet got people, man. They didn't gave people the ability, man, to be anybody, man. Now, you know, you could be you could have just got down, signed up for your gym membership, man. And then you can hop online. All of a sudden, you're a gym guru, you know? That's what the internet has given the people the ability to do. You know, you hop online now, all of a sudden, you're a gym. When I was growing up, you had to come outside and prove yourself. It wasn't all this bad. You know, online, uh, keyboard, warriors, the internet, uh, you know, and made it to where people are like experts at everything. You know, you can't tell them nothing. 
They'll sit, and then when you you talk reply, they'll sit there and leave a whole paragraph, you know, trying to prove their point. I'm like, bro, all you got to do is post the video. I just want to see what you look like, man. I just want one time, man. That's all. I just want one time somebody to post a response or a reply, right, with a picture, a video, of what they look like, you know. I seen a couple of them, though, man. I've been on their pages, right. One dude left the YouTube on my YouTube channel. He left the comment. He was talking some shit about, uh, what'd he say? Oh, I was doing the hammer curl. So I usually do a hammer curl, boom. I do one on each arm, then I do a double. And he was saying, is all that weight I'm using necessary to sacrifice the sacrifice on my form, using awful form. I'm like, bruh, look at my arms, bro. That's all, that's, the, that's where the, the conversation should stop right there. Look at my fucking arms. What do you mean awful technique, bro? All natural, bro. I don't take no no dumb, no drugs, no steroids. Former athlete, bro. This is all natural. 20 years grinding, bro. This the only shit I take. Some damn six-star creatine. You can get this at Walmart for damn, what, $12? C4, the same shit. This some damn equate collagen and protein shakes. This is all I take. I don't take no... I'm just fucking big, just natural, bro. All hustle. Bro, telling me my form is, is awful on arm. Bro, look, I had people before when I was in Planet Fitness, bro. Not kid you not. I'm not making this shit up. This is no cap. I had a dude one time, man, come up to me, man, at Planet Fitness. Dude was bigger than me, bro. I'm talking about dude was cock diesel. He came up to me, man. You know, I seen him. You know, when you when you like a, 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 a get to a certain point in your gym career working out, you game, game respects game. You know, you see another swole dude in the gym, you like, that motherfucker swole. I know he, he had on his business, and he probably thinking the same thing about you. But he came up to me at one point during my workout, and he was like, hey, man, can I borrow your arms for the weekend? You know what I'm saying? Mind you, this dude was bigger than me. He was cock diesel. I'm talking about swole. He bigger than me, asking me. I had dude, man, when I was in food line before, man, grocery shop, I'm going up, I'm walking, I, I already got my groceries, I'm going to the car to unload the groceries in the car. He walks up to me, man, he was like, hey, sir, can I ask you a question? I'm like, yeah, what's up? He was like, how long did it take you to get that big, you know? People just don't come up to you and ask you questions like that or say little things like, can they borrow your arms for the weekend for their health? It just don't happen. You, I, if they, if people coming up to you saying shit like that, you obviously doing some shit right, man. You know, so these people online, y'all probably not doing shit. You know, the ones that's making these trolling comments, saying your form is all, or they hating, man, they hate on me, man. They hate on me, man, for wearing Crocs in the gym. I'm like, hey, I'm going to keep wearing them, man. What? Hey, they they slip resistant. I'm going to keep doing me. I'm a, any, anybody, I go in the gym, right? I'm, I can go in there right now, any day. I'm benching 405. 405 pounds with no spot. Unrack it, boom, for reps. I've done it four times. Four, well, no, most people don't even get to 315. 315 in their whole life. Most people are not going to get to benching 315 ever in their life. I'm benching 405. Anybody that, that's doing that, man, can wear what the fuck they want to wear in the gym. That's how I feel, man. Who gonna tell me different, man? Yeah. They don't never say nothing to me when I'm at my uh, when I go to these other gyms in person. So why would you come online? It's, it's, it's idiotic, man. These people that come online, man, you know, and they just think they know everything. They gym guru don't know shit, don't know shit, man. Don't know they mouth from the asshole, man. They just idiots, man. Goof, jack offs, man. You know what I'm saying? They just I don't know what's up with people, man. It's like you go know, and then people like. The one, most of the ones I've seen, they do got a profile picture nowhere near me, bro. Can't hold a candle. I'm like, bro, you a grown man. It look like you weigh about one, 160, bro. I, I was wearing that as a damn 10th grader in high school, bro. Like, come on. Y'all got to give me a break, man. I just don't get these people, man. I just laugh. Most of the time, I just laugh at it, man, because I'm like, man, you know, it's just showing, it's showing the algorithm that people responding to my content, whether it's good or whether it's hate, man. You know, that's all it's showing, man. I'm like, hey, if you got time to come online and hate on another man, you ain't getting no money for real. You can't be. You ain't got no women. 
you ain't doing, you, you probably ain't doing shit. You probably live in your mama's basement, man, playing the video game all day, jacking off all day, man. Probably miserable, depressed with your life, man. So you want to project your shortcomings onto the people like me, you know, that's making a difference out here, man. Like, it ain't, you ain't going to knock me off, Jack. One thing about it, man. Yeah, that shit don't, that shit don't phase me. I'm just making this video just speaking on what I see. You know, I could give two fucks about what these comments they be saying, man. Most of the time I don't even respond. Sometimes I respond like today, the dude, I, I put a video out, you know, most of my videos is working out, but one of them I put out, uh, I think I had went out. I ain't been out in a minute, you know? And so I went out, you know, I'm smoking my cigar. I'm just saying a little motivational message. You know, dude comment, he said, man, ah, what the hell he said? He said, I'm supposed to be a uh, motivated dude, look like he's stoned, this and that, man. If anything, that's going to motivate me to stay off drugs. I'm like, dude, you don't even know me, bro. You ain't never met me a damn day in your life, bro. For one, I work for the federal government. I'm a federal government employee. We don't smoke. You can't smoke. We randomly get drug tested, bro. So ain't no way in hell I was looking stoned. You know what I'm saying? For two, yeah, I went out. I don't go out like that no more. I usually just go home, go to work, go to the gym, come home, and work on my content, and watch TV and chill at the crib. I don't go out there, so I went out, you know, but I'm like this. I got home at 3 a.m., right? 3 a.m. in the morning. I still got my ass up and worked out at 8 a.m. You know what I'm saying? What did you do? What did you do today? You feel me? Besides come on my page hating on me. What the fuck did you do, man? Tell me what you did. I'll wait. I'll wait. I won't hold my breath. Yeah, I won't hold my breath waiting for you to reply. You know. What did you do? You know, I went, I got home damn three in the morning, laid down, still got my ass. Most motherfuckers that go out and drink, man, whatever, they ain't getting their ass up to work out, man. They still in the bed. 12, 1 o'clock, man, in the afternoon. By the time they done woke up, I done, I done already did the home workout. I done cooked breakfast. I might have cleaned up a little bit around the house or whatnot. I done did all these damn tasks, you know? So you don't know me. These people, that, that's what the problem is, this, this, this algorithm shit, right? Where anybody can come on your page, man. These people just come on their page. I think they be bored with their life. So they just trying to project their shit onto you, man. But we already 10 steps ahead of these clowns, man. They, they, most of these dudes is clowns. They wouldn't say the shit to us in person at the gym. If anything, they'd be looking at us like, damn, I want to be like him. Damn, I want to be pushing weight like he pushing you, though. So, I'm, hey, me, I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing, man. Because, shit, what I'm doing is obviously working, man. I get a lot of the love always outweigh the hate. You know, I'm getting way more love. You know, the haters going to be there regardless, man. If you ain't got no haters, you ain't popping. You ain't doing nothing. You ain't doing something right. If you, ain't, if you ain't got no people that's criticizing you, hating on you, man, trying to knock your shine, man, you ain't doing something right, man. If you do, that means you're doing something right. You know what I'm saying? It just, that's just how the world revolves. That's how it goes, man. It's always going to be haters, man. That's what you got to remember, man. Whatever you do in life. You got to remember, it's always going to be jack boys, clowns, haters, man. People gossiping behind your back, man, talking shit. Then when they see you, they all smile. He, 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 want to shake your hand, be, but I don't want none of that shit, man. Keep it 100 or don't keep it. You know what I'm saying? If I know you hate me, man, and I know for a fact, that's, I'm cool with that, man. I know not to go around you, man. But when you sometimes acting or you fake, you talking shit behind my back, man, and then you buddy buddy in my face. Nah, that's even worse than a hater, man. Keep them people, man. Watch them people, man. They secretly jealous of you, man. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I ain't mean to go on this crazy rant, man. I just, sometimes I just be like, I be just watching shit, man, how this shit going, you know? So I know, I know it's only gonna get worse as my YouTube channel grow. You know, my following grow and shit. I already know. I'm, I'm prepared for that, man. That shit don't, that shit, the thing about it, that shit don't do nothing for me but motivate me to work harder. You know, they just added fuel to the fire. So they, if anything, I should be thanking the haters. I'm thanking the haters. I'll be like, damn, they got me fired up now. Boy, I can't wait to hit that damn gym and go eight shit, man. Because they know how I do when I go at the food, man. You know, that's what, that's what anything... If anything, they just motivate me to grind harder. So to the haters, man, if you watching this video, 
you know, I know you probably ain't gonna like it or nothing, man. But if you watch it, that's cool too. If you a hater on my, on my on this video right now, I just wanna say from the bottom of my heart, thank you, keep it up. I need you, I need you to keep it going, man. Cause the hate just makes me work harder. So you really, you really helping me. In reality, you helping me get better. You know, cause if I'm working harder, that means I'm grinding hard, I'm running this shit up. So just keep it up, man, you know what I said. Like I said, smash that subscribe button, man. Subscribe to my channel, At The Ghetto Bodybuilder. Follow me on TikTok, Instagram, At The Ghetto Bodybuilder, my personal fan page on Facebook, Ryan Smoot, that's my real name, R-Y-A-N, last name Smoot, S-M-O-O-T, man. You know, like I said, I got merchandise for sale. First, this one of my shirts right here too, man. This is, I made this shirt. It's for sale right now too. First team all gym, man. Shop with your boy, man. I got it. Hoodies, t-shirts, man. Just check it out, man. Let me know what you think. www.theghettobodybuilder.com, man. I'm open to all comments, uh, questions, concern, anything you want to know, man. Love, you want to show some support. Donate to the channel. I got my cash app in the bio, man. Uh, anything. Yeah, love, hate. If you want to leave hate on my page, that's cool too, man. We're going to take it all in stride, man. Because one thing about it, man, as long as I got air in my body, I'm going to keep on grinding, keep on keeping on, keep working, man. That's all we can do, man. Y'all stay up. Y'all stay humbling. Y'all stay hustling. Keep working, man. Don't stop. Can't stop, man. They can't stop us, man. This is God's plan. Let's get motivated. Boom!